Today I want to tell you guys about a skin broadcast that I did on Periscope a few weeks ago and I want to tell you guys how you can have soft skin and how to reduce the appearance of cellulite. Yes, there is a way to reduce the appearance of cellulite. Now you can't get rid of cellulite. There's no such thing as getting rid of cellulite. But I can definitely give you a tip that I use that definitely minimizes the appearance of it in your clothing without your clothes on. Um, so that way you guys can have great looking skin. I'm also going to teach you how to have soft skin, baby bottom soft skin today. So get your pad and paper. Let's get started. The first thing I want you guys to take note of is this bath oil by Avon. It's called Skin So Soft. Many of you have probably already heard of Skin So Soft. It is one of their most popular items that Avon has. It's been around for years and it's called Skin So Soft. Okay. The next thing I want you to do, write down the body shop. Okay. The body shop. It is mango oil from the body shop. And the reason why I use mango is because mango is the oiliest fruit and therefore it is going to moisturize your skin very, very, very well. You got almond, you got, um, what is that? Uh, what is, you got almond, you got cocoa butter, those kind of things but not as moisturizing as mango. I have used every last one of those products, but mango, being the oiliest fruit, will keep your skin soft and looking uh, healthy all day long. Even after you've gone a whole day with your clothes on, it won't be ashy. Your skin won't be ashy when you take your clothes off. So the Body Shop, mango, all right? And don't get this confused with uh, this, what is it called, the Satsuma? They have one that looks just like this one. Get mango, all right? Next thing I want you to take note of is this body brush. This body brush right here, this one that I have here is by Elemis, but the, there's also some in your local area. You can't get Elemis everywhere. I actually purchased this on a cruise ship many, many years ago, at least eight to 10 years ago, I bought this brush on a cruise ship. But you can get a similar one as well if you're not on a cruise ship. You can get a similar one as well at Whole Foods. They have one there as well. So this brush right here. So let's get started with what you need to do in order to have soft skin and to actually minimize the appearance of cellulite. So before you get into your shower and get into the water, I want you to take your brush and I want you to just briskly go up onto your skin. You're just kind of, you know, a little bit of pressure to it, but just go up in an upward direction on your skin. And I'll tell you why you need to go upward instead of downward in a minute. So just go upward. Do both arms, do all over your legs, do on, on the upper part of your legs, get up in the butt area of your, of your body where you have all the cellulite, inner thighs, your feet, do your feet as well, do your calves, do your entire body doing an upward motion, okay? You don't want to forget up in here in your breast area as well. Not on your breast, but just in the nodes here, okay? You want to brush upward in that area as well with this brush before you get into the shower. And what that does, it, it actually wakes up your skin, it actually gets the blood circulation going, and it exfoliates your skin as well. So it kind of takes off the dead layer, the top layer of your skin, so that way any products that you put on your skin will definitely penetrate a lot better if you do not have dead skin on top, okay? So you're gonna do that, then you're gonna put that aside. You don't wanna put this brush inside of your shower or get it wet, it's just not that type of brush. It's not a wet shower type of brush. It is a dry skin brush only, okay? So after you've taken your shower and you're getting ready to get out of the water, I want you to actually use the bath oil before you get out of the shower while your body is still wet. Now what I've done is I've taken the bath oil and I've poured it inside of a little squeezy bottle here that way I can just stick it in the shower, take it on road trips with me as well. But just spray your body all over before you get out while your body is still wet because again, it's going to help moisturize your body. And just rub, rub around, rub it in a little bit. And then when you get out, just pat yourself dry. You don't need to go all, you know, completely dry. Just pat yourself a little dry to get off some of the excess water. At that point, then I want you to put on the mango by the body shop. Okay, put this all over your body and be um, liberal with it. Don't be so shy. Don't take a little bit like my mother. My mother takes a little bit and think it's going to go a long way. This is not Crisco. <laughs> a little dab will not do you. Don't be scared to use the mango oil. 
you want it to get to a point, even if it looks like it's white or it's caked on or whatever, it's okay. It's, if you have dry skin, it's going to actually absorb into your skin quite nicely and you're not going to have a problem with that, okay? So definitely do not be shy in using it because it will definitely absorb within your skin. So you want to just go over your body. Again, you want to go into an upward motion and you want to make sure you go upward. You want to go upward on your thighs, you want to go upward on your calves, just go in an upward position of when you are putting on your lotions and when you're actually doing the brush. You want to definitely go upward instead of downward. Why? Because if you continue to brush your skin or rub your skin in a downward motion, guess what happens to your skin? It may begin to sag. So we don't want sagging skin at all and that's why I say go in an upward uh, motion so that way you kind of go against gravity. Okay, so now we've put on our mango. We're all set to go. You've rubbed it in. You've done everything you needed to do. Now, if you want to top off and just put a little bit more oil on top just to give you a nice little shine, a nice little sheen before you walk out of the door for the actual body parts that are going to be seen in whatever dress that you're wearing, you can definitely do that because you would just, again, just have a nice little shine on your body. You won't be greasy and that kind of thing. It definitely, definitely, you'll smell good, you'll feel good, and you'll totally look good. So you guys have all these products. These are excellent, excellent, excellent for having soft skin and reducing the appearance of cellulite. First day, you're going to, trust me, you'll be praising yourself that you actually took these tips from me. I'll have other skin scopes coming up and broadcast coming up with you guys as well. I'll make sure that I post them on YouTube for you. Please, if you're interested in subscribing, please hit the subscribe button. Go to my website if you would like to know more about me. My name again is Dana Simone and I am a TV talk show host here in the Chicago area of the Dana Simone Show, sponsored by eSmart Workout Hard. So if you are interested in learning more about my show or more about me, please go to DanaSimoneStovall.com. Thanks. Thank you.